We are so happy to accommodate the first ship at, at uh, Doha Old uh, Port, and we are waiting to accommodate the second and the third one at, at the same place. It's a sustainable uh, option uh, from the accommodation part, so uh, we will have enough more rooms and different options for the fans. And of course, it will, uh, it will not be uh, available after the tournament time. On World Europa, we will be hosting 6,700 fans, plus minus, but we have two other ships coming, so our capacity will be over 10,000. On board World Europa we have 33 restaurants and lounges, uh, different experiences, so all immersive. We have uh, shows in three different locations. We have attractions such as the longest dry slide at sea, bumper cars, uh, roller disco, drone academy. We have uh, a yacht club which is our biggest yet. And overall there is always something on so it's 24 hours of entertainment our guests can enjoy. I think it's a very central location in terms of its proximity, so I think it's going to be very easy for the fans to you know, enjoy all the facilities and amenities that Doha has to offer and then easily transition on our ships.